Arn Anderson's coming out. What is this old ass gonna do? He's gonna give him a strategy? Like, here's how you take your ass whooping correctly. You gotta, you gotta pump, you gotta puff your back. Like, what is he doing out here? Oh shit, here we go. Alright, let me get ready. <sighs> you come out with a belt, right? I love that suit though. He he's styling profiling tonight. Looks like MJF has a belt around his waist. I think he's gonna be using that. Whew. Listen, they had a graphic up on AEW's Twitter page. It looked like a fucking whip that they used to whip the slaves with. So that shit had me riled up for a minute. Look like he about to use his belt, though, so I'm fine. What if he uses like the metal part to whip Cody? That'd be fucking oof. <laughs> Here comes the man of the hour, Cody. I don't, I don't know. I mean, this is a really nice belt, don't you think? Far too nice to touch you. Oh boy. I want. Bam! How disrespectful. He's making him use his own belt to whip him. Next, he's gonna invite his mom and dad in the ring to watch it too. So, are they whips across the back or are they whip across his body? I think it's gonna be whips across the back. I mean, most kids have more than ten lashes across their back when they were younger, so I don't think it's that bad. But you know, could be worse. Uh, remember that sound. <laughs> Woo! There's one across the shoulder. Referee's in the ring. I love it. The referee's in the ring like, Alright, you only have ten whips. Is any more to ten, you're being a squall fight, and you won't get your match at AEW Revolution? That feels Brit. So, all the heels are gonna come out here and watch Cody get whipped. Is that is that what we're doing right now? Because Britt Baker's out there, too. Woo! This is... 12 years of Cody right here. Not quite 12 years of Slave, because that was way worse, but 12 years of Cody right here. Woo! You can see the welts on the back. It's only three in, too. Arn Anderson's coming out. What is this old ass gonna do? It's like, hey, I've had enough of this. Just, just, just do it to me. Just do it to me. Yeah, I don't know. He's gonna give him a strategy. Like, here's how you take your ass whooping correctly. You gotta, you gotta pump, you gotta puff your back. Like, what is he doing out here? If I was Cody, I'm telling his ass to scram. Mm. Oh, that one's kind of late. But he's doing it to like the same area too. Oh shit, here it is. There's the fourth one. Fifth one. Oh! There comes the. So why are they all coming down the ring knowing they can't do shit? <laughs> Cody should be lucky that he's not using the belt buckle to whip him. Or he doesn't have one loop hanging off. Because that would be that would hurt a lot. That. If he had. Oh! There's two. They got two kids front row. Oh! I love how there's just two kids front row watching this shit. Really? They got Warlow do one? Woo! Shit! Damn. Man, it's like they keep whipping the same area, too. It's like all red and purple and bleeding and shit now. I ain't gonna lie, it's getting some sympathy from me. I guess they're going overtime because this segment's about to, this show's about to be over. And he's like, you got one more, baby. You got one more. You gotta love it. Come on, Cody. You got like 30 seconds for y'all go off air. What was that? Some fans just tried to jump MJF. But that was the AEW segment, the 10 lashes. That was very intense, man. I won't say that much. It was a very, uh, very intense segment. I enjoyed it. Well, I didn't enjoy it, but, you know, it was unnerving. It was everything it was meant to be. And now every time Cody takes, like, a body splash, it's going to mean so much more because he has those lashes on his back now. So, yeah, it makes a lot of sense. I can get behind this storyline. I just think that, uh, Cody is doing a lot for himself, it seems like. But he is the top baby face in the company, so what are you going to do, right? What are you going to do? Back to USA Network for the final minutes of NXT. You know, they're probably still live. Oh, of course they're still live. Hey, did you enjoy that clip? I know I did. Well, there's plenty of more where that came from. I stream on this very channel every Wednesday, 8 to 10 p.m. for my live reactions to WWE NXT and All Elite Wrestling Dynamite. For more clips like this, discussions about AEW, NXT, New Japan, and stardom, subscribe to the Tyler Cook Williams channel. Peace out, guys. Cool.